All right, guys, on this episode of Doc's Eye TV, we're going to head deep in the marsh to go chase some redfish, sight fishing them with our brand new galaxy colored matrix crawl. This is a really cool color. This is excellent for bass fishing. It, it looks like a frog in the water if you rail it on the surface, and the redfish seem to gobble it up pretty good also. On this episode, it got cut a little bit short as we broke down for the first time, I think, ever in the middle of making a Dockside TV. So it's a little bit shorter episode than normal, but I figured to show you guys us broke down as we have crazy days also, and give you a little bit of advice to get a CETO membership in case you get in a situation like this, you always have backup to come rescue you. Um, this is gonna be in your Matrix bait box this month. This is a great little color. We're gonna give several packs of these. This will be one of the items in it. And stay tuned for the other Doc's Eye TV episodes to see what else is going to be in this Matrix bait box. Also, for all of our YouTube followers, we really could use a favor from you guys. Our Instagram and Facebook was hacked and deleted, and we really need your help to help build it back up, especially to Instagram. So please go follow us on Instagram. It's Matrix Shed underscore Doc's Eye TV. That's our new handle. And we're giving away a Matrix bait box to every day to a lucky follower that helps build our um, following back up on Instagram. So again, Instagram, Doc's Eye TV underscore, I'm sorry, Matrix Shed underscore Doc's Eye TV. Again, Matrix Shed underscore Doc's Eye TV. Follow us, enjoy this episode of Doc's Eye TV. And be looking for these in your next Matrix Bait Box. Leave your worries at the door And come enjoy the water It's sea total Peace of mind If you both won't go Don't you worry Cause you know It's sea total Peace of mind Galaxy. All right, so what we're doing today is we're fishing with the new Galaxy Matrix Crawl. We're fishing very adverse conditions, a lot of wind. It's very cold for this time of year. I've got my wintertime jacket on, a big front just came through. We're trying to do some sight fishing, which we've caught a few doing that. But with the wind and, and it's so breezy, we're also doing some blind casting on what we call choke points, which is where duck ponds meet each other through little bitty channels. guys well, we've had a very eventful day here as you can see the batteries all out and exposed that's never a good sign um, plus I had a weak starting cell as I had the live well running also the GPS and a lot of the accessories I've been kind of digging up some dirt a lot today the hot alarms went off a few times and I wanted to crank it and I was trying to roll over and then all of a sudden it didn't have enough voltage for the crank. So, I've had that happen several times in my life. You simply take your trolling motor batteries, put it on your start, where your start battery is, fires it right up. The thing is, we're fishing 20 mile an hour winds and heavy vegetation. So we've spent too much voltage on our trolling motor batteries. So now we have three pretty dead batteries. So we're stuck out here. And this is the reason 
you want to have sea tow when you fish pretty often or even if you only go a handful of times a year you really want to have sea tow. I didn't have to bother sea tow today as I have a friend on the water that's going to come help jump us off here but it's one of those days and um, we were making a dockside TV video we ended up catching several nice red fish enough to make a video and I figured why not go ahead and finish the video and talk about some boat and safety like that. What we were using though today as far as the fishing goes was the Matrix Crawl, the Galaxy Color on our quarter ounce swim bait hook. And also what you can do with this lure is if it's really cloudy and you want to blind cast it, I like it on an eighth ounce. That way it'll run higher. You can really run it like a rivet frog right over the grass and they'll come up and hit it like a top water. So Sight fishing's about to get pretty good. Today was very adverse conditions, but we still got the job done as we caught a little well of fish. Some really nice heavy redfish too. And um, figure we might as well sit right here and close this episode of Dockside TV out while we wait for our friend to come rescue us. And until next time, good fishing. Make sure to subscribe to this Matrix Bait Box to get these new Galaxy Matrix Cross.